Hi everyone and welcome back to another tutorial. Today we will be working with master pages in Adobe InDesign. When you add objects and content to a master page, they will appear on all the pages based on that master page. So why would you want to use master pages? Working with master pages allows you to place an object, type, or artwork on that master page and appear on all the document pages. It will be positioned in the same spot on every page that has that master page applied. For example, we will automate page numbers on our master page in this tutorial. Let's set up the title and page number for the time being. You can be fancy once you learn how to do these things. If I wanted to change the title's name, I could automatically change this on the master page and it would change all the other pages for me. On every page, the objects are placed in the exact same spot as my master pages. If you notice, I could select the master page in the pages panel, but I'm not working on them. Double click and this will open the master page in the document window. This method is preferred because you know for sure you're using the correct page. Facing pages are two sides to the master page, a left hand and a right hand. The left side will be all your even pages and the right side will be all the odd pages. Any items placed on the master page will now appear on the document page. Page number markers are commonly added to master pages. When master pages are applied to document pages, the page numbering is updated automatically, similar to headers and footers. In the Pages panel, double click the master page to which you want to add your page number. Create a new text frame large enough to hold the most extended page number and any text you want to appear text to it. Position the text frame where you want the page number to appear. In the page number text frame, Add any text that will come before or after the page number. Position the insertion point where you want the page number to appear or select the number. And then go to the main menu and then choose type, insert special character, markers, current page number. Your number or letter should automatically change to the letter A to correspond A master. This is correct. If your document has facing pages, Create separate text frames for the left and right master page. To add a page number on the right side, repeat steps 1 through 4, or select the left text frame, copy and paste this on the right hand side. You should be able to see the effect on your regular pages in the Pages panel. Please note, if you place anything on the master page, items will be locked on the regular pages. For example, I'm going to double click on a page number in the Pages panel so I know that I'm off my master pages. So I will click on page one. When I try to move my page number, it is currently locked. If I want to unlock things from the master pages of my document, hold command shift click on the frame on a Mac or control shift click on the frame on a PC. What happens is then the frame becomes unlocked once I do this. Just as a reminder, when you're ready to work on other pages, make sure to double click on a page number in the pages panel so you know what page you are currently working with. Thanks everyone for watching. If you enjoyed the video, like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel. And I will see you next time.